latest headlines and most accurate forecast from 41 Action News. I'm Kevin Holmes with 41 Action News. Here are your headlines for December 23rd. A Kansas City activist calling on the Justice Department to investigate the Fraternal Order of Police and the Kansas City Police Department. This comes one day after the Jackson County prosecutor dismissed an indictment against the owner of a tow truck company, all because of a recorded phone conversation between that owner and the police union president, Brad Lemon. The prosecutor claimed that call undermined the integrity of the investigation. Activists say members of the department and the union both broke the law. It's difficult for us to have the type of tenacious and courageous leadership if you do not have moral courage. We are in a crisis point in our city. The prosecutor's office added it's also obtained at least one email between another officer at the Kansas City Police Department and Lemon pertaining to this case. These actions have been referred back to the Kansas City Police Department for further investigation. The police union is not commenting. Later tonight, Kevin, I'm going to be monitoring the new data for this for early next week, New Year's week, Tuesday into Wednesday, right before New Year's Eve. We do have a potential for heavy snow, maybe some snow mixed with ice and rain. So we do need some good precipitation. So hopefully this comes together, gives us some precipitation. We'll just have to see if it creates problems with it. 17 degrees tomorrow morning to start Christmas Eve, 27 degrees at two tomorrow. So a cold, crisp, Christmas Eve day, Santa leaves from the North Pole about 6 or 8 o'clock tomorrow night and it's supposed to do, be due in Kansas City after midnight. And our seven day forecast, 41 on Christmas Day, 55 on Saturday, and then colder next week with that chance of rain, sleet, or snow. Remember to get your news and weather anytime at KSHB.com.